The good news is that first dose vaccinations continue to rise at this point. We also heard last week from the province that the timeline for second doses has been sped up. However, trying to get it all coordinated and to do it all at the same time becomes very complicated. And so some decisions have to be made. As a result, some people aren't going to be happy. The emphasis in Toronto is clear. Wait your turn. They're not done with the first round just yet. We want as many people as possible, young and old and everyone in between, to get their first doses as quickly as possible, and then at the appropriate time, with the appropriate spacing between the doses, to get that second dose as well. With 70% of all Toronto adults now partially vaccinated, it's the highest and lowest age groups that have shown the most initiative and capability of getting their first dose. The highest being the ages between 60 and 79, and to the surprise of Mayor John Tory, residents 20 to 29. The kids are all right. Thousands of young people have stepped forward to get vaccinated, teens, people in their 20s. We're fast approaching the milestone of 80% vaccinated when it comes to the age group between 20 and 24. And yet the city says it will continue to put its efforts into a youth vaccination strategy to target more young people in areas where uptake is lower, rather than shift its main focus. Partially the result as well about having the right mix of clinics that are happening. Most of the mobile and pop-up clinics today across the city are around schools. That's not an accident. Um, and it's not an accident that that's resulting in some very positive uh, results uh, for us. It's the wrong move, according to some, who say there should be a pivot to getting the majority fully vaccinated with two doses something that should be easier with increased supply and more appointments becoming available. I think that we need to get the second doses out as soon as possible. I mean, in, in many places in the hot spots, you have, um, um, you know, 65 or more percent of the population vaccinated. And so the rest of the people are people who either uh, don't want the vaccine or, or don't want it right now or have difficulty accessing it. This afternoon, York Region confirmed that the age for booking second dose appointments in that part of the GTA has now been lowered to 70 years and older, and those who already had a spot can rebook earlier. Toronto's top doc says they're not ready to do that yet, though shots will still be reserved for the highest age bracket before others get theirs. Because we know that it, the, the most severe outcomes, the most serious of the outcomes associated with COVID-19 infection, unfortunately fall to the oldest in our community. Another reason for not prioritizing second doses just yet, Dr. Davila said that the age category from 30 to 54 is also among the lowest. And so she wants to make sure that people within those categories also get their first dose first. And she hopes to do so in the coming weeks.